Hey guys, what's up? Uh, so as you can see, I got my RODI in. Um, it's all hooked up with all the fittings and also the the booster pump right here. Um, I'll show you guys how I hooked that up in a bit, but let me show you guys how I did this hookup first. And yep, let's get to it. All right, so we have two things. All right, first one at the top that is a hose thread adapter um, it's right here hose thread adapter take a good look um, and if you turn it around it shows you that basically and that's what it looks like letter A that's what it looks like alright and then after that you can see we got this little contraption thing going on here where if I go like that it does that, and if I pull this, it turns my RO on. Okay, so basically it goes like that, and I pull it, RO turns on, and then when the pressure drops, when I turn it back off, the pressure drops and it snaps back in. See? So, that's that, and that's called a aerated diverter. I got the quarter inch barb, because I have quarter inch tubing, um, and it basically goes straight into that barb right there um, so yeah that's what it is and that's what it looks like on picture alright so that being said I have my tap water inlet connected from here um, so when I pull this water goes up comes up through here this is a pre-filter um, once it passes there it basically comes out from here it loops up through this tube and it goes into here, which is the, oh wait, this is the outlet. Um, this comes down, okay. This comes out, and then it comes down, and it shoots right across to the carbon block, right there. All right, and then this is the inlet. So this comes straight down, and it hooks up right here, this front one. So basically what happens is the water flows through here, it comes up, it comes up through here, through the booster pump, comes back down from the booster pump into the carbon block right there. Um, so yeah, and then for electrical, I brought the little adapter up from the bottom, kept it in a nice dry spot, and basically you unplug it and plug it back in when you need to. All right, so that's my bird, sorry. Uh, let's get, let's see this in action, all right? Um, so what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna turn on the sink without the booster pump on. All right, so as you can see, RODI is on because there's no water coming out. Faucet is on, all right? And right now it's flushing. Let's get this cold water in. Right now it's flushing, and because of my flush kit I got going on here, if you look, there is zero PSI. But when I turn this valve on my flush kit, if I can turn it, all right, you can see that the pressure is going up, but it stops at 40. Now, if I plug in my booster pump, which I will do, and if I can do this on camera, okay. So that's my booster pump. Pretty loud not fun but you can see my pressure has gone up to 90 now that's perfect that's exactly where I used to run it at you can see waste is coming out got a nice steady stream of clean um, and yeah we're running at 90 psi and that's what you're, you you want to run at on this specific unit um, so if I turn it off then it makes a horrifying a horrifying sound um, so you don't want to run this pump dry So let's go ahead and unplug this guy it's Surprisingly really hard to do that um, But yeah, anyways you get the point so that's my RODI setup. I hope you like it. Um, I didn't really I Couldn't really attach this to the unit somehow like screw it in um, my unit's not big enough um, So I just put it on top but I mean, it's not going anywhere. It's pretty secure. Um, so yeah, that's it. That's that's it with this RDI unit.
Um, so yeah, I hope you liked the video. Let's go ahead and flush this. All right. Oh crap. All right, you guys, that's like an epic fail right there. But yeah, you can see it's flushing out and pressure dropped back down to zero PSI. All right, I got water flying everywhere. I gotta, I gotta end the video now. All right, so thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like button. If you dislike it, hit the dislike. And if you wanna keep up with my new tank build, which is very, very close, and we're almost done. So yeah, if you wanna keep up with that, subscribe. And yep, thanks for watching, goodbye.